welcome back to my channel this is Mayuri so if you've seen my just previous vlog which I just posted last week it's all about me going off beat in Gokarna where I have mentioned that I will be going to Paradise Beach for trekking for it is actually the same day but I do not want the video to be too long so currently I have kind of reached the nearby beach and we'll have to trek about one and a half kilometer to um, reach Paradise Beach and uh, We've also got the tent here which we will be going there and putting it up so let's just start and um, Ten Mole will be accompanying me if you remember her from a previous video uh, whom I met who's a rider who's from Chennai so let's just begin this trek so Ten Mole is here with me and we've just parked um, her vehicle here so parking is absolutely not an issue they're just gonna charge about 50 bucks and then um, you can just go but there's two ways to actually reach this you can actually trek from Belkin beach and then come till here or else you can just come here to the paradise beach and that's the trekking point of one and a half kilometer that you can just go so we will be trekking from here now so this last part there was just super dense and we also actually saw a peacock but then it just uh, hit itself as soon as it saw a human being so yeah Ten mole is right there we gotta cross all the way there and reach till there right now so we somehow happened to miss a little direction and we were supposed to come from this side but then we ended up coming from that side there so yeah it's not really definite there's no um, you know arrows or anything good for you to understand but it's nonetheless we've reached here yeah we are just getting our tent there that's our tent in the green color one so we're just gonna enjoy the sunset here and um, chill for today night so that's our tent they've already set it up and we don't have any sleeping bags or something but let's see how it works I really wanted to experience actually setting up a tent but uh, not here, maybe somewhere else in Gokarna where they're going to let you set up a tent, you can do it. But this tent is okay, so they don't have any sleeping bags or pillow or anything but they do have mobile uh, washrooms. So that at least we have and uh, that place is where they have some kayaking boats and stuff and they have food and water thankfully. It's quite humid, they have fruits that and we will set up a fire camp tonight and enjoy the view. That's our tent, we just finished setting up. So that was really good experience. Um, ultimately, we still got a chance to set up our own tent, and I think everybody should once set up a tent on their own in a remote area. But just make sure you're safe, and it's a good experience on the whole. So it's our new tent. It's all set up, and the view is amazing up here. We're gonna be watching the sunset here and chill for today. the sunset so the sun is almost setting and the waves the sound of the waves are just so amazing to hear I have done this previously in Goa also wherein I captured a beautifully pink looking sky which is meeting the sea so hopefully I get to do this here also let's see it meeting few more people uh, who are staying in our hostel so I think it's just gonna be a fun night we are all tenting together so we are at least about five people right now 
so we're just going on the top of the rock to um, capture the sunset so possibly you will be able to see it on my Instagram so do check it on Instagram That's a bonfire there so the boys have done all the attempt to do it we're just sitting here and enjoying and that's the ocean which is currently pitch dark but we just have this bonfire at least now Happy morning. So we've just woke up at eight o'clock, which is really light for us uh, waking up right now here in the beach. But um, as you know, yesterday it was really dark and they didn't have any lights here. So we ended up just you know having a bonfire and just you know everybody dancing around. So there were about twenty people and it was a good crowd. So we just enjoyed and just went back to sleep about two o'clock at night. and woke up this to this wonderful view here the beach is so empty and so clear i must say and you can actually see how nice this looks so we did have a good dinner yesterday we got um dal chawal a good quantity for 100 bucks yesterday so we did have a good dinner Today for breakfast is a uh, maggi and red omelet and stuff like that. Maybe a coffee. This beach is actually really clean, and this is a private-owned property, so um, you just can't randomly camp here. So um, the, the responsibility will be taken up here. You need to come here. You need to either have bookings beforehand, or you need to come here and then check if there's availability, and then do the camping. So that's it about this beach. It's just really amazing being here and waking up to this view, definitely. So there are two ways to go back. Uh, either you can trek back, or you can just take the ferry and go to the nearest point. So if this video was good enough, then give it a like button and then do subscribe to my channel and let me know your thoughts on this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.